Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. I blame Pixie for being up this early. 6.45 a.m. Although we were up at 5, weren't we? Because someone decided to sit up in bed and stare at me. Not Diana, this time. It was Pixie. Thought she needed something. She didn't. I couldn't get back to sleep. It's Monday morning. I've got to host a hangout for a sponsor here in another few hours. We're showcasing the gadgets behind me, which you probably can't see. I mean, you could see that video, you just can't see what's behind me right now. The good news is I'm finding discounts on tons of LEGO sets right now. Big discounts for big sets. And the bad news is I don't think anybody except for Stephanie is seeing them. Ah, all righty then. She's blossoming! For a second there, I thought you were going to say amen. You're going to hell. Thank you, Giannis Regis. Our bacon will now be flatter with a cast iron wood handle bacon press shaped like a pig. Uh, hot sauce or candy canes for breakfast. You know, I think that the next time I have a bout of insomnia, I'll start listening to an audiobook. We've got a full library now. It grows by the month because we have the subscription. Audible.com slash Locker Gnome. If you want to download a free audiobook, give it a shot. Got nothing to lose. See all these boxes? Diana broke them down last night. Earlier, I asked, if you could sum up the average Perillo vlog with a string of emoji, what would it look like? And I think the best response so far is from Imogene Cuckoo. That's pretty accurate. So as I'm doing the hangout, Little Miss Pixie starts snoring, and I tried to wake her up by chucking the little Vader coasters at her. Very lightly, very lightly, and she woke up and shifted and everything was fine. Sorry about that. Hello? Hey, I know you probably know this, but they had a set of mini pigs on sale on Amazon for their lightning deals. Oh, uh, I probably have them all. Well, I don't have okay. all the minifigures, <laughs> but I mean... Well, it's like some kind of box set type thing, like some, I don't know even what it was called, educational set or something. Oh, yeah, I know. I got those like two years ago. Oh, okay. Well, then they were all right. You know, despite the amount of people who thought I was interrupting you during the Perillo picks, I would say it was a raging success. Yeah. A lot of very, very good feedback. People loved it. They said we were funny. She's in the bathroom. I think. Heavenly Ball Wand. Hey, Chris and Diana. I thought your ICEO could use some help getting into the holiday spirit. Well, thank you, Roberto. From Throwboy. I'll have a blue Christmas without you. I'll be so blue thinking about you. Decorations of red on a green Christmas tree. Don't mean a thing, dear, if you can't keep that on your head. I think she likes it. I can certainly wait to share the resource uh, when it's ready, of course. Uh, but I just wanted to send the link out to a few people, not just to get their feedback, but certainly to see if they wanted to sign up as an affiliate for it. We were talking about something called CPU which will launch in just a few days. CPU could stand for Chris Perillo. You, you said you were going to make bacon in my dream. I mean, that's what you said when I was dreaming. I did. Yeah, so... I don't remember that. I know, because I dreamt it. Well, I dreamt that you made me, like, Tim Cakes. And you bought me 
You know, you know what? This I'm, is getting unrealistic. Okay. You know what? I, I, I've never trips. even made you one cake, let alone ten. You've made bacon before. You got me drooling too. Not because of the cake, because of the bacon. And you want to know when? She doesn't want to be on camera yet. Yes. It's gonna be a big reveal. What? Where are you going? A big reveal. I don't, I'm just. You can show me. Okay. I can I show her now. Apparently, wanna... she's changed in the past minutes. Yes. Um, I'm still my sinuses. We tried to sleep with the humidifier no, last night. No, you tried to sleep with the humidifier. I just didn't care. I was ambivalent. Quit playing with my pad. You're making it go wacky. And my sinuses are still not like there. Yeah, hun. A humidifier is not going to help that much. Anyways, back to my dream. Uh -huh. I had a real dream that a subscriber sent me, you know that recess chest you have outside? Mm -hmm. One of those full of makeup. Whoa! Yeah. That's a wacky dream. I, I was like... I don't I think that's ever going to happen. I know, but... I was like, oh, I opened it up and it glowed, like light came out. <laughs> was it Marcellus Wallace's soul? I don't know, but it was a lot of makeup. I think it was Marcellus Wallace's. Diana said something to me the other day that I wanted to get on record. She said all she wanted for Christmas was me. Yes, I did. There was no qualifier. You said just, just me. That's it. Yeah. So that's all you're getting. I would be okay with that. I'm going to test this to see if... You I are really telling me if I had a choice in either what getting you gifts. you think that you think you think. If I had a choice in either getting gifts, like a bunch of gifts, or you leaving, I would choose you staying. A bunch of gifts or me leaving. You would probably. <laughs> well, depending on how long you'd be gone, a little break would be. <laughs> Depends. I'm just kidding. What kind of gifts are we talking about here? <laughs> this is what she's thinking. I'm kidding. Was I interrupting you again? It's, are people getting mad about uh, that? Some people are getting... Uh, but everybody, I think... Well, okay, not everybody. I think most people understand that it's just a part of the flow, you know, to kind of keep things moving along. Yeah. I do it to you, too. I do it to him all the time. Do you know who I am? No, I, I'm I'm asking, do you know who I am? Because I really do not know who I am. <laughs> or I'm supposed to be. A superhero? Yeah, something like that. But I don't know if I'm good or bad or what. I thought I was an X-Men. Because I had the X down here. Right next to Wicket. Does anybody know who I am? You know Dasher and Dancer and Prancer and Vixen. Comet and Cupid and Donner and Blitzen. But do you recall the geekiest reindeer of all? Tardis, the blue nosed car. I mean, red nosed car. Diana and I have agreed upon one thing, and that is we're going to get our Christmas tree tomorrow. I guess the only real question is will we decide to get the same tree? Or. Will she like a different tree than I like? That's never really been a problem, though, in the years that we've picked out trees together. In fact, I think the first time she ever picked out a Christmas tree in her life was a couple of years ago. And I remember recording that video, but I don't know if I still have that video recorded. I mean, I kept. It's obviously still recorded. It didn't just unrecord itself that I know of. And to help put Diana in the holiday spirit, she needs popcorn in the tin. So I got her some cheese-flavored popcorn. It's a good start. And with that shopping excursion, I have now completed Diana's stocking. The popcorn will not be going in the stocking, though. She's got other stuff, other goodies. I love packing stockings for Christmas. It's my favorite part of Christmas, I mean, the Christmas day of the opening presents and stuff, uh, you know, when I was a kid. So it stands to reason it's my favorite part as an adult. More the giving of the stockings than receiving. Of course, I like receiving good stockings, too. Oh, I missed you too. Uh, I can't find the Christmas popcorn bucket. <gasps> I know, it's gone. I got you the popcorn, now we're missing the bucket. Are you sure it's not in your Stormtrooper closet? Stormtrooper closet. Oh yeah, check there. I think it's there. Yeah, okay. Well, it might be in there then. You got the popcorn? I did? Well, Let me go get it. I got the popcorn, you get the bucket. Okay. And if you don't have the bucket, you can't have the popcorn. What? I don't make up the rules. 
Okay, you can have the popcorn even without the tin. Yeah, it is a big, big, um... Bag. Yeah, bag. Well, we can't remember what we did with the tin. We may have tossed it because it was dented. It was a Star Wars tin, a popcorn tin. Yeah, I think we did get it at a drugstore. And I haven't seen any other Star Wars popcorn tins out there this season, so we may have to try to find one online. You want a little Christmas tree? I do not. Marshmallows I picked up for Diana as well. Oh, it goes on top of the Christmas tree. Yes, it does. Well, you don't have, you can just put them both in your mouth. I got an Imperial Stout. Oh, again. Aw, oh, what happened to all the nacho cheese that you made? It's over here. Oh, so it is. Nachos. No, mine don't have as much cheese as yours. And postcard. <laughs> From Edward Webb. I did get a lot of cheese. You sure you don't want any? No, it's all yours. Have you stirred the cheese in a while? No. All right, I better do it. Try it. It's constipationalicious. You'd think that it was sagging, but that's actually pretty firm right there. It's really firm if you feel it at the base, just kind of, it's firm. Star Wars has been on TV for the past few hours. Return of the Jedi just started. They're out of Jabba's palace now and Luke's about to fly off to see Yoda. Spoiler alert. I'm a little tired. Someone came upstairs and started to cuddle with my left leg. Thanks for liking, commenting, subscribing, and sharing all of our videos.